This guy needs no introduction. This is Destro. DC Wave. I don't remember what wave it is. I was real lucky to find him. This motherfucker right here is going to be worth about $100 within the next two months. As he gets older, he gets more expensive. They are not going to remake Deathstroke. They're not going to make a better one. This is the best Deathstroke out there. This motherfucker comes army style. I mean, like, he has his stick, his guns. Oh, his gun's messing up. Hey, hold on, let me fix it. Oh, damn, dude, shit. Alright. Hold on. His gun. Well, I didn't show you the gun. The back. He has a badass gun. He has a gun on the side. He has, like, bullets all over him. He comes with a sword that comes out. You see the sword there. His stick comes out. He His head moves. Great paint job. Uh, kicks anywhere. Uh, knees move. His joints are great. Articulations are 10 out of 10. This is the rarest, hardest figure to find. I was real lucky to find them. There was only one of them in my store. I was pretty pissed. I'm like, out of all these damn stores, there's only one and they were like, yep, only one. And you're the only one who's got that one. And I was like, man, I'm going to have to get them. I got this one in, like, February. <laughs> I was real lucky. I mean, I saw the other stores. They had the same waves, but no death stroke. Just nothing but, um... Who was in this damn nigga's, uh, wave? Oh, yeah, nothing but, uh... Sinisters. Sinister, whatever his damn name is. See? I think that's him. I think that's his. Is it... Uh, Deathstroke, yeah, there it is. The Terminator. See, when I went to the stores, all they had were just that damn thing right there and Green Lanterns. No Robins, no Nightwings, no Deathstroke. That was stupid. But yeah, he poses and does great poses. He's a villain. Badass. Look at that stuff. I don't know what that is. That is badass. I mean... There they are, the rarest, hardest figures to find out there. Like I said, I have, in my city, I have two Walmarts, two Targets, two Toys R Us, and I have, like, this other toy store. But they didn't have these. I mean, they only had one out of each because I'm lucky. You know, I go, I, I have the money to get these, so I'm good. I'm straight. You know, but don't, if you, I mean, these are expensive, you know, if you get all the waves, you know, you're going to get, go, like, bankrupt and stuff like that. So, I mean, if you can't, if you can't afford it, don't, don't go through hell, just get them. I mean, they're really not, they're worth it, okay, but yeah. But, um, be careful, you know, use your money wisely. I mean, I don't, I don't have kids, I don't drink or smoke, so, I don't, you know, so all my, so if I was to drink beer, it's like basically getting these, though, that's the way I think of it. But. I don't smoke, drink, or any of that stuff. You know, I don't go clubbing. I don't do any of that party stuff. So all my money goes to, like, I guess these toys. And they're really cheap. They they run, like, about $10 each. So, yeah. And sometimes they have them on a special. Like, you get two two for 20 minus $5. You know, that's $15 for just two. So invest your money wisely. You know, don't, don't go out there and just throw it out. You know, whatever. Oh, and I don't go to strip clubs either, so this is my tips, I guess. So, yeah. So, if you're into these, save up. You know, be smart. Don't be dumb. Don't don't go out there and waste all the money and then be like, oh, what the hell? So, yeah. DC Universe. Mattel. <laughs>